This makes me look like a granny. Like a grandma here. Hang on a minute. I am a grandma. <laughs> to share with you uh, just some information in regarding to the hashtag, <laughs> hashtag <laughs> crochet cardigan challenge that Jeanette uh, DOY creations has put out there to, um, to everyone who'd like to join along it's going to be a make along and it is basically a crocheted cardigan or you can knit the cardigan if you if you prefer and it's uh, there's no time frame on this uh, make along so just as you're making it either do a video or you can post it on uh, instagram uh, and just use that hashtag crochet cardigan challenge and um and we'll see how things go so i just wanted to share with you the yarn that i've chosen to make my cardigan so i haven't quite decided on this on the design of this uh, cardigan um, most likely it'll be like three quarter sleeves and because you know hot flushes and um, I haven't fully decided whether I'm going to knit the cardigan or whether I'm going to crochet the cardigan because uh, when I show you the yarn um, depending on the amount of yarn that I'll need for the particular pattern that I choose to do or I may just wing it just like Janae's doing in DIY creations she's just winging it which I love that idea. So I've chosen this one here. It's a Vitalana. Vitalana yarn. And it is Lofty DK. And it is a chain. If you can see that there. It's sort of a chain construction. So even if I just choose a very basic stitch, it's going to look pretty, I think. It's a gorgeous sort of pink hues. Very pretty. And this yarn here has, it's the colorway is called Mittens. It was um, from uh, Knit Crate, I think last year I got this one. And or could it be the year before, I'm not sure. It is 48% merino wool, 20% baby alpaca, which makes it gloriously soft and lightweight, and 32% organic cotton. It's a DK weight and I have four of them show you there's four there so I've got four of them so um, the yardage or the meterage is 250 meters which is approximately 274 yards and they're all 100 gram skeins um, or skeins <laughs> but um, what I thought was um, I have one skein here of um, Yuru yarn and it is a silk DK, so it, this one here has got 300 yards. But it is, um, I think it would go nice together. And what I might do is maybe just use this as an accent, because um, I sort of feel that I'm a thousand meters, which this is a thousand meters, um, or you know, just over a thousand yards. Thousand and what's that, 25? Thousand one hundred uh, yards. Uh, may not be enough for a cardigan um, for for my size which would be like an extra extra large size um so this one here is 85 percent merino wool and it is 15 percent silk i've only got one of these um, but i do have a little bit more which i think this is 100 grams and the leftover that i have here is approximately maybe 30 grams maybe a little bit more um, this is left over because I made my sister and my uh, brother-in-law um, some fingerless uh, crocheted mittens and that was for last winter so now we're coming into uh, well, we're in autumn and we're coming into another winter but I'll put a picture up here And that's the the mittens that I had made so um, I have that so that's one option to use as extra yarn whether I um, stripe it in between or just use it as an accent for the cuffs maybe around the collar uh, the opening of the cardigan and possibly the bottom the bottom um, hem edge 
the other option that I have is I have this one here. Now this is Vidalana as well. The same sort of chain uh, construction type uh, style of yarn. But this one here is, it's a sports weight. However, when you um, use it, I think, if we hold these up together, I think it'll be pretty compatible. Because when you hold it up together, it doesn't look that much thicker. It's slightly, there, you might be able to see that better. It is slightly thicker, but that, that's okay. I don't mind that at all. The only thing is, this one is gloriously, luxuriously soft. This one, it's soft, but it's not so much soft. It, it does have that woolly feel, but it's not, it's not scratchy, but it doesn't feel as soft a touch as this one. This one here is Vidalana Ascendance, and the colorway is called Broken Stones. Uh, if you can see, it's sort of a creamish, it has a slight flex of like a grey stone sort of um, tones going all the way through it. It is 100% fine Peruvian highland wool. Um, and it is, like I said, sports weight. It's 328 yards, which is 300 meters. So you actually get a little bit more here than here. That's strange. And yet this one here looks thinner than this one. 250 meters, 300 meters. Obviously the style, the way it's woven, I guess, maybe just the style of the actual yarn itself. Um, but it's 100 grams, 300 meters, 20, uh, 328 yards. And it re recommended um, knitting needle is a US 5, which is a 10 mm -hmm. millimeter. And uh, I think 10 millimeter. Um, crochet would be possibly a uh, 3.75 to 3.25 which seems very small <laughs> i would most likely like the uh the finished effect to be a little bit um drapey but a bit loose so i would most likely be using um if i do crochet 4.5 maybe even a five millimeter hook uh this one the same same recommendations 3.25 to 3.75 millimeters in hook size and again the same this one here so that that's all i have for you today i uh, just like to get on here and um, just share that i am going to partake in the hashtag crochet cardigan challenge so stay tuned for um, give you updates as we go along and also just a quick reminder um tonight at midnight australia east australian eastern standard time here in australia is the um, closure or finish of my birthday giveaway so you still have a little chance to get in there and um, put in your comment um, just watch the video I do ask for keyword or words I put three words that you can use either or of to so that I know that you're entered and as always like if you like this content and subscribe to my channel that way you'll get uh, further notifications of when they come up and I will be recording a video most likely um, tomorrow for the winner. And I will announce who the winner is. And remember the prize uh, that I'm giving is a beautiful skein of yarn from Stitchcraft and Wizardry. And also some stitch markers that I've made in gold or silver. if I'm feeling generous. Okay then, thank you very much. Take care, stay safe. Uh, it is very rainy and wet here. Uh, it's been like this for the past few days and uh, there's been some quite a uh, few flood warnings um, all up the coast of New South Wales, Sydney, uh, here in Australia. So do take care if you're out there on the roads, uh, slow down, be aware uh, and take care. We'll see you next time. Thank you, bye bye. crochet and more. I'm Anna and I haven't fully decided whether I'm going to make it crocheted or knit. Now that will depend on um, the style that I choose. 
Janae. She's See you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.